<clears throat> okay, uncontrolled left. See if it makes the decision fast. We're assuming we have the same amount of cross traffic, which it looks like we will. Almost identical. Yeah, we got a lot from the left. It's going to creep to see from the right. Okay, it's empty to the right. After, so after this, this Cherokee, we're good. Yeah. So it should go now. It's waiting for a left right turner. It should go now. It should go now. It's wide open. Still wide open. Okay, I'm tapping it. It's, yeah. There's zero cars. You could see the snake coming out, but it wouldn't. It wouldn't even move. So hardware three won that one. It's, it's weird because normally this this has better decision making than mine. Yeah. In five hundred feet, turn left onto Santa Catarina Road. I gave it a good three seconds there, so. There's the stop, slow stop further back. That's definitely consistent between the two yeah. hardwares. Going under the speed limit's consistent, except harder three does it a little more. Yeah, yours definitely is doing it more. I, I wonder if it's because of the, how quickly it could process. No, I don't know. I'm not an AI expert. At least you own the product and it paid for FSD before. Yeah, once or twice. Man, that guy sent it when he took off. <laughs> See by the condition of his car. Yeah. slow down afterwards like look at that that was weird yeah, we're actually gonna send that one in send that snapshot in. we should do the loop two times see how it'll do see if it's the second time it's different yeah to do that okay this one yours completely missed the foot's over the brake here Nope. In 500 feet, turn left onto Via Joyce Drive. Vehicle was not slowing for speed bump. And last but not least. Nope. All three it missed. Vehicle not slowing for speed bump. Now turn left onto Via Joyce Drive. So, although the first one, it went over it and then slowed for it after, after the, fact. the fact. To 11 miles an hour. Yeah. So let's add that back. Oh, wrong spot. So we want to come back to here. See if we can freak it out of here. Oh, there we go. So let's see. So it'll slow as we come around this turn with the truck, the vehicles on both sides. Which is fair. Yeah, because it. it you, there could be people coming out, there could be... So usually it starts slowing here. There it goes, a little bit. That's about that. the same. Now is it going to accelerate as we come down this hill? No, oh, interesting. So let's see how it handles the uncontrolled left. Wow, it's dragging too. This build's just been doing. There's no one around. Interesting. So it's three or four miles an hour under the speed line. Mine only does that if there's a lot of cars, like close proximity on the curb. I don't think it's well based on the fact that that left turn it showed. Let's see what it does with this. 
definitely going to have to creep forward because we have poor visibility from the right. It's also really far back. Okay, so we got an opening from the left now, and we got cars coming from the right. Now cars coming from the left. Okay, three more cars from the right. No, okay, it's going to have to wait. Now this guy's going to block our vision to the right. So a human driver would have went right there. Yeah. Okay, we got a gap in the left and the right. Okay, so it can go after this after quarter. this guy. No, nope. oh, now this guy's turning left, so we gotta wait. Once this Passat turns left, we're yeah. Good. So it should go now. Okay, that wasn't bad. Very good. Missing the other one was fine because it was a tight. That was a tight gap to squeeze into. That was pretty good. Now I'm curious. My car never sees these speed bumps. Now I haven't tested it with AI4, so let's see what your car does with these speed bumps. You might need to intervene, Zach. I just thought of it. These are sharp. No, are they sharp speed bumps? No, they're more like what we just went over on the other one. Oh, it'll be fine. Call it when you see it, because I know your car's are worse than mine, so. One's in my neighborhood. This one's been nailing every time. It's in a really good way. Okay. They're all marked. They're not unmarked. The marked speed bumps, it's been yeah. great. Okay. Dips is another story. Gotcha. Cannot take that at 29 miles an hour. That's this is the issue I keep seeing. Speed bumps are not reliably seen. It's those because the ones in my my area are normal, like full length speed bumps. Okay. I've been seeing them. It's these perfectly. partial ones that see the next one. Sometimes it tries to go around it on this one. And nope, and it's not going to slow. Nope. You're gonna, oh, oh, you didn't do that. No, I didn't. It do saw that. that one. Okay. But it did late. Yeah. Last one. I'm willing to wait to the last second. Yep. Ooh. Oh. Nope. nope. It, it was thinking about it. Second. Yeah, it was thinking about it. Okay, yeah. So we'll do that in the AI4 car and see if it sees them. It's very smooth on the turns. It's also been doing very good at passing um, like Amazon Prime trucks, USPS vehicles, garbage trucks. It's, it's doing good at recognizing it's going to stop for a short period and just pass it versus just sitting there wondering what it's going to do. It always slows on this turn for me because of the gap and the poor vision and then accelerates as it comes out of the turn. Now yours has a destination set so it's probably not going to do it but there you go. Yeah. 